Cloud computing is one of Microsoft's strongest verticals, so let's say you want to become a principal engineering manager at Microsoft's Azure division. How do you hack it? Well, if you're getting a Bachelor of Engineering from Zurich University of Applied Sciences, you're off to a great start. And then you follow up your fancy degree from Switzerland with a Master of Science in Computer Science in the Computer Security track from Columbia University. Maybe you've heard of it. And you're not wasting time while you're in Columbia University, you're doing serious graduate research in security policy management. And if you're after your graduation, you join Microsoft as a software engineer to work on security-related matters. And your interest in hard work in the field of security pays off because you're able to lead the creation of Microsoft's identity platform, which is pretty much Azure Active Directory version 2. Active Directory was and is a game changer in terms of identifying who you are and connecting you to the resources you should have access to. So if you have that on your resume, you are set. It took this person almost 10 years to become a principal software engineer before they got promoted to a principal engineering manager. As a principal software engineer at Microsoft, you're making a total compensation of 322 grand, of which 214 grand is base, and 73 grand is the liquid gold that is Microsoft stock. And you're making a comparable salary as a principal engineering manager.